Hello there and welcome back. In this video I am going to continue my flask series and I would like to show you how you can add a fab icon to your site you are building. This is important because when you uh, bookmark a page or you load the site you can see a small logo on the either the bookmark page or on the browser tab and uh, this this is the so-called fab icon and uh, this is very uh, easy to implement in flask all you have to do is i have created this fabicon uh, folder in which my application will live so i will create a new folder which is called static and uh, into the static i'm going to copy a fab icon so here we are, this is the file icon, and uh, this is how we will reference it. The other thing that is needed is to create this uh, Python file. And uh, <coughs> in this Python file, you only have to add a few lines in order to achieve it. And uh, we may want to import the OS module. We want to import from the Flask module the Flask object, the send from directory function and the run the template function. We will create our application the usual way. And we will create a root which is going to be called slash fab icon that ICO. This is the standard format, and we will define the fab icon function which is going to do a return with the send from directory function. And here we will join the OS path with the up.root pass and the static. So let's uh, see and uh, we would call this the file icon the ICO which will be returned and the mime type is always going to be image V and D mime Microsoft dot icon. If you don't specify the mind type, it is going to be looked up. It it is uh, not really necessary to define it, but uh, if you define it, you can save some time. And uh, <coughs> if we Define this app that root forward slash. This is going to be the index function which returns the render template of the index.html. And let's save it. And we need to create the templates for that. And this templates folder is going to hold the index.html file, which will be returned by this function. And there is not much in this uh, index.html, <coughs> but we will also define layout HTML. And here we are going to have this block defined which is the head and this is the end block and this is also important because you want uh, to save some typing type using the ginger template by saying that every consecutive uh, page you have either inherits from the layout.html the head block touch everything you define here is going to be present on all your subset 
or you can override them. So here we will have this short cut icon, which is the reference for the URL for static file name is the fileicon.ico and uh, yeah so let's define our index.html and in the index.html we will say that we want to extend the layout.html and we want to have our head block and we would like to call the super which will reuse the definitions in the layout.html so Basically that's it. Now if I run this application, desktop, icon, and I will run it differently than you may remember. So I will say that I defined the flask cap variable, which will be called favicon.py, and I say I would like to activate my virtual environment, which is the Flaska scripts. Activate and then Flask run. And now, as you can see, uh, it started the application. And if I open my Chrome and navigate to this page, you can see that here is the little icon that I wanted to add. And there is also an arrow which says that encountered an unknown tag extend because it's called extends. <coughs> Let's stop it and run it again. Let's reload the page. There you go. So this is how you can add uh, the fab icon to your site. I hope this has been informative for you. Give it a thumbs up if you like it and subscribe for more. Thank you for watching.